Regarding personal care, I think the non-contact mapping system will improve the way that we can treat patients because we will be able in complex arrhythmias to better understand the individual arrhythmia substrate. And we'll move a step further from just doing an anatomical based approach. For example, I remember one patient that we treat a couple of weeks ago with persistent atrial fibrillation. This patient had isolated pulmonary veins from prior procedures but he was still going into persistent atrial fibrillation, very symptomatic. With conventional mapping, conventional contact mapping, we could not find any good target to do another ablation. Uh, so we decided to do a non-contact mapping approach. And by that, we could really clearly define uh, new targets for ablation, focal discharges at the roof of the left atrium. And we could ablate that and the patient converted into sinus rhythm during the procedure and now stays into sinus rhythm during the months that we now see them back in our outpatient clinic. So I think this is a, a very good case for an individualized approach.